They say you can actually build a working airplane out of bamboo. In the classic TV show MacGyver, the hero once did just that, using nothing but bamboo, duct tape, and a cement mixer engine. It supposedly took him only four hours to build a two-seater plane that could fly. To see if that was even possible, Grant and the team decided to give it a shot. They started by studying light aircraft designs to gather the key specs they'd need. Their plan, use bamboo instead of aluminum for the frame, secure every joint with duct tape, and connect the moving parts with wire so everything could still function smoothly. They even tracked down the same model of cement mixer engine from the show, a 9-horsepower motor. Grant attached a wooden propeller, and in testing, it produced enough thrust to push a cart carrying three people. Sure, it was slow, but based on the physics, a bamboo airplane might actually get airborne. Carrie covered the frame with a layer of plastic film, and Grant rigged up a radio control system. All told, it took them three full days to build. A far cry from the four hours MacGyver pulled off on TV. For the test flight, they headed to an abandoned quarry with a 100-foot cliff, perfect for takeoff. Because the plane was too big to move in one piece, they brought it in sections and assembled it on site. Once it was ready, Tori and Carrie climbed into the cockpit to run the final system checks. The engine roared to life, and the plane began rolling forward. Then they strapped two 150-pound crash dummies into the seats with duct tape and started the real test. The bamboo plane rolled slowly toward the edge, lifted slightly off the ground, and then nosedived straight off the cliff, crashing hard into the ground below. If the engine had just a little more horsepower and a bit more speed, it might have actually taken flight. So, what do you think?